Yo guys, what if I say that it's finally possible to get 73 plus FPS, on Ether SX2, with any device, well you don't believe me, then I'll prove it to you in today's video. This emulator just keeps getting day by day. I'll be telling you guys all the new features added into Ether SX2. Also I'll be showing you guys how to access them, since they aren't on Play Store yet. So make sure to hit that like button, subscribe and turn on all notifications for future updates related to this emulator. So let's get started. The first really cool feature here is a fix in Framabr for being too small in some games, example test drive. Now this feature may add a little more performance, possibly just a little bit. The second fix here is disabling by linear upscaling and advanced options. And now my friends. Here is the best feature that this update has. And it is fractional scaling option. Yay. And if you don't know what does that mean then congrats. Let me show you. So this is new experimental build of Ether SX2 shown on the screen, and I've opened the settings of the app. And I'll scroll to graphics section and here take a look at the upscaling multiplier, by default it is set to 1 times. And. These new options let me set the multiplier as fractions for example 1.25, 2.75 etc. And most importantly if you scroll it upwards, there will also be upscaling less than 1. Which will help extremely low end devices to run games smoothly but this will make the graphics of your games worse, which might not be that enjoyable. The next feature that Towerith added is tap to hold option for touch. Screen buttons. So here is the new build of Ether SX2 under controller setting under touch screen. Now I can't click on tap to hold it's because I have to be in game. When you are in game open the menu, click on the controller option and scroll down to tap to hold. And from here you can change the behavior of almost every button. These all features are just too amazing, Talrith is on fire these. Now if you want to download the build that supports these features go to ethersx2.com, click on download and scroll down and click on alpha. The click on the first folder and now you can easily download the latest test build of Ether SX2. So that's all for today's video guys, if you like this video leave a like and if you dislike this video then still leave a like. Ciao.